Hi folks, we're going to go through how to restore the Northwind backup file in SQL Server Management Studio or SSMS. So I've already opened up SSMS. Now I'm going to open a connection to the SQL Server I installed as part of the Express Edition. So I go to File, Connect Object Explorer. The correct server shows up by default since I only have one and connect to it. Then I expand the connection and I want to restore the database, so I'm going to right click on database, click on restore database, I click on device, and then the three dots here, and then add allows me to actually, actually choose the file I want to restore from, which is this Northwind 2016 back that we placed in the appropriate backup directory from the install. Um, and you may not need to do this next step, but I'll show you just in case. I'm just going to click OK here to select the backup device. If your install directory is not the same as this one right here, if it's anything other than the default, you'll have to go to Files and relocate the database files. Because in the actual backup file, there's a pointer to the file locations at the time of the backup. And it shows the original file names and by default the restore tries to put them in the same place so if that doesn't exist then you need to relocate all files by using this checkbox here and putting in the appropriate uh, file names or sorry the file folders so I don't need to do that I'm just going to skip it and I'm going to click OK to start the restore restored successfully I'm going to right click on Northwind, go to New Query, open up a new query window, and I'm going to type sp underscore tables and execute that just to get a list of tables. And here we see the tables in the database. You can also see them by just expanding Northwind and opening up the tables area. See the same list. And there we have it. Thanks for listening.